Yo, 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 what is going on guys? Chili Philly here, and today we're going to be playing in the Royal Tournament. We're going to try to hit 10 wins. I did hit 10 wins on my other account. Did not play the greatest, but we're 10 and 3. I'll probably uh, show you some of those videos as well, or those replays. But uh, yeah, guys, thank you so much for all your support. If you want to leave a like and subscribe, I really appreciate it. But yeah, let's hop into the first match here. So I'm going to be playing my Golem Pump deck. Hopefully we can... Uh, Make out well against Brendan here. Give him the good luck. And I guess we'll sit here for a second. But yeah, guys, if you want to check out some recent polls on my channel, I'd really appreciate it. I've been posting a lot of polls. I've been posting daily, but thanks again for all your support, guys. <clears throat> and I will E-Dragon in the back here. And he does have a hmm, executioner. What do I want to play here? I guess we'll golem. And then we'll just have to Phoenix on top of this. And Phoenix is getting down here. And not the end of the world. He spent a lot of elixir on that push. But it is tough to go in with your golem off rip. And we will get some Phoenix damage. He has to use his e -Wiz, and we can just use a Bar Barrel on top of it. Actually, we will try to hit the Bomber as well. And activate our King Tower. And that's beautiful right there. I will definitely take that. And off to a great start against Brendan. But yeah, guys, I am trying to work on my uh, commentating as well. I know it's been a little tough sometimes, but uh, trying to like talk and play at the same time at the same time is definitely a little difficult sometimes. But I will eat dragon here. Um, he's gonna executioner. I guess I'll phoenix as well. And I don't know why you use the clone, honestly. <laughs> But I'm just going to pump up in the back here. And. Okay, so he's going to E-Wiz. So let's see what he's going to do with this push here. He's going to go in deep with a barrel. Dark Prince counters that easily. So, hmm. And. We're going to start up the big golem push here. He's going to bowler. We can just Phoenix in a minute here. We're actually going to wait for his Executioner. And there it is. We're going to zap everything. Boom, boom, boom. He's going to clone. It's not going to do much. And yeah, this push could be a good game. We can get another Golem down too. So yeah, not worried. Good game to this guy. And yeah, guys, pretty easy stuff there. We just had to wait for trouble. As soon as we got that pump down, easy win. But yeah, want to know. I will see you guys back in the next match. Match against Nova here. Good luck to Nova. And we will start off with a bar barrel at the bridge. He's going to play a bandit. I am hoping it is not Pekka. I really hope it's not. Mm, yep, and it's looking like it is Pekka Bridge Fan. And there is the Pekka. And I really don't have anything here. Not good. I have to Lumberjack to pull this back. And I guess I'll E-Dragon. Does stop him. Uh, hmm. Oh, so unfortunate that our Phoenix... Wait, it does respawn. All right. We do have hope. He went in really aggressive. We're gonna pump up in the back. We don't have we don't have a choice here. Hmm. <clears throat> I'm trying to think of how we're gonna win this game here. He went in really aggressive, but we can't really punish him because he has Pekka, so and Tesla, so this is gonna be a very difficult matchup. And I will just Dark Prince here. Man, that Tesla is going to still be there, so. Um, actually, he might just charge to the tower. That's 
fine. I'm going to bar barrel so the Ewiz does not get any shots on the tower. And I guess I'll Golem. I really don't have another play. I know he has P.E.K.K.A., but we can get a Phoenix and E-Dragon down on top of it and shred it down. And I will play the E-Dragon first. And then the Phoenix, and I just do have a Tornado is really all. And I will Tornado everything in. Look at that. He's going to do the same. And we're just going to have to go with another Collector here. As long as we take out most of the stuff, I am cool. And we will. So that P.E.K.K.A. is pretty much gone. And I have to Bar Barrel here. Hopefully it gets down in time. It does. Pretty clutch. And nice. <laughs> no dash from that bandit. He dragon in the back. Hmm. I guess we Phoenix. Dark Prince. And we wait on the tornado here. And now we send in the tornado. And he is doing a good job countering. I want to get down another pump, but it's going to be very difficult. And he gets down another P.E.K.K.A. I will Phoenix and Dark Prince, but I don't think that's going to do very much. But it is taking out that one P.E.K.K.A., so... Hmm. And I will Elixir Collector here. We have a slight damage lead. And I will Lumberjack and Bar Barrel. Get rid of that Executioner. And that bar barrel is not very greatly placed, but it's okay. We're going to Dark Prince, and we're going to Tornado everything in here. Just want to get some damage on that tower, but we're going to Phoenix. And, hmm, I guess we have to Lumberjack and bar barrel. And I will Dark Prince here as well. And I have to Tornado everything. Hmm. And it's not the end of the world. I will collect her in the back here for triple. And I don't know if we can defend, though. It's going to be insane. Golem down instantly because we're... Look at this elixir we're getting here. I will bar barrel and dark prince. And we actually might be able to break through here. And, yeah, that, those elixir pumps really help us out. And we're going to break through. I'm going to golem again. And we're in a solid damage lead. He's just desperate at this point. And that will be a good game. So, GG's to this guy. And, yeah, guys, pretty, pretty nice win there. And I will see you back in the next match. All right, into the next match here against this person. We'll give him the good luck. And we'll start with the Dark Prince, and they're going right in as well. Not good for us, so I might have to actually Tornado all of this. And a terrible start. We have no Elixir and no cards to play. So we are going to chill back. He's chilling. Hmm. What to do, what to do. The Mini P.E.K.K.A. comes out. I guess we E-Dragon, don't really have a great play, and I will have to Bar Barrel as well. And that is brutal, man. This guy is going in, but that Dark Prince will charge. So, that's fine. Bats are coming in. Alright, cool, cool, cool. He gets a hit. I'm alright with that. And at probably 8 or 9 Elixir will collect her here. And alright, hopefully we can build up an Elixir lead. He's going to go in with the E-Barbs. I will Lumberjack. And I do have enough for a Tornado. And I will Tornado this in. And it does go for the Pump. Unfortunately gets a hit, but better than taking damage on the Tower. And I will Phoenix here, Bar Barrel, and Dark Prince. 
And unfortunate that that egg doesn't respawn, but Dark Prince does get a shot on the tower. And I can get another pump down just in time for double here. Alright, I will Lumberjack, and I have to Tornado again. That's all I can really do. And I will Tornado up to the middle here, and it gets a shot on the pump. Hmm, Golem in the back. Alright, he's gonna play a Wizard. Let's try to get a good Tornado here on our tower. We will Phoenix in the back, try to cycle to another Phoenix. E-Dragon. And I guess we Dark Prince so we can try to prevent the enemy. But that might not work out for us. And I guess a Lumberjack to just apply pressure here. Tornado. And we do break through. <clears throat> Pretty good stuff. And look at that Phoenix respawning. That's a good game. I'm sorry to this man. But GG's guys. I'll see you back in the next match. Alrighty guys, into the next match here against this person. We'll give him the good luck. And I guess we'll Dark Prince at the bridge. He's going to use a Tombstone. That should go to the tower, but he has to use a Skeleton King. So, not too bad for us. I'll Lumberjack now. And I'm assuming he has Poison, so I'm going to wait for him to use it. I'll use the Bar Barrel to clean up here. And Lumberjack doesn't take too much damage. He will Mother Witch though. Pretty interesting. Don't really have any uh, good value for him, but I guess I'll take it. And the Mother Witch will lock on. And I will Phoenix on his RG immediately. And I will Dark Prince in the middle here. And it's going to go in the right lane, so he's going to... That's fine. We're just going to get a lot of damage here. We will Lumberjack. I will Lumberjack as well. And even if... Yeah, that's fine. We're just going to Tornado everything in. Get rid of that Tombstone. And look at that damage on the right side. I'm okay with that. We get a lot of damage on his King Tower as well. So it's not the end of the world for us, honestly. I'm pretty happy with what's going down. And we can get a pump down now for double elixir here. So he's not playing anything. He's hanging out. There is the RG. I played that a little low. Should have played the Phoenix higher. Well, Dark Prince. And RG will get like three hits. Not good for us, but we do have a full pump on the field. And we are going to get a golem down in the back. Alright. Big time plays here. His mother witch isn't going to get any good value. So, not worried. He's going to lumberjack. I do have a phoenix and a tornado. Dark prince. So, like, even if he uses his ability, I can just tornado. And... We're looking pretty solid here. I will E-Dragon again, just because we need some damage. And he fireballs, but he does miss. I will Lumberjack and Bar Barrel. And it's going to be close here. Two, and that's a good game. So GG's to this guy. And yeah, guys, I will probably see you back in the next match. This guy here throw out the good luck and dark prince at the bridge and it's an eagle in deck oh no and he just puts an inferno dragon which is not too bad for us and i guess i will just barbarian barrel here lumberjack phoenix and we're not looking too good i have to tornado this in over here but doesn't look like it really matters. Honestly, I think we lost. 
Does that activate King? And it does, but that doesn't even matter. He's gonna take most of our tower here. I'm gonna collect her, try to just save ourselves. And it's not over. It's definitely not over. Golem in the back. And he's gonna go with an immediate E Golem. But I will Dark Prince on top here. And get a Bar Barrel down. Hopefully we can get some Elixir in a second here. And I will E-Dragon. We're going to lose our pump, but good E-Dragon by us. So we will take his tower. I will Phoenix in the back here. Take out these Elixir Golems. And is it worth the Tornado? Not really sure. But we will Dark Prince in the opposite lane. He doesn't have Elixir right now. Okay, he had enough for a Lumberjack. But we're going to let that go. We don't have much of a choice. We just have to save up for a golem in the back, I think. And that's what we're gonna do. Here's our push, guys. It's coming, coming live. I will E-Dragon low. And I have to Lumberjack, hopefully in time. Oh no, not in time. All right, Phoenix down here. And Dark Prince, hopefully this speeds up. Oh, nice tornado. What a tornado. That saves us right there. And we're just gonna spam another Golem in the pocket and Lumberjack here. And E-Dragon for the chain, maybe. All right, nice. We should be okay here. I will Dark Prince. And this is a crazy game, guys, but I think we got it. Yeah, it's gonna be a good game. He can't do anything. Good game to this guy. <laughs> crazy game there, guys, but if you did enjoy, yeah, please leave a like and subscribe for that one, guys. Alrighty, and into the next match here against Far Farum Deja. I'm not sure if that's pronounced correctly, but my fault if it's not. But we'll throw out the good luck. And a Valkyrie comes out. Not the best thing for us, but I guess we'll bar barrel. Don't really have a good play. And I'm just going to collect her. They're going to bar barrel as well. And there's the poison, so good value. Do we just go in with our golem now? I think so. We'll have like five elixir here. Boom. Look at that. Five elixir. Six now. Almost seven. Whew. And there's an ice wizard. So I can electro dragon tornado. And I could possibly put in a dark prince and just wait a second. But I will tornado now. And hopefully this golem just doesn't stay too slow for too long. But nice. That one golemite's going to go to the tower. And that is free damage. So I'm going to collect her here. Force out a poison. And there's the poison. So I will take that. So now we're going to get some elixir here. He's got maybe like two, three right now as well, but... We should get two more elixir here. This pump will help us out. And that means a golem in the back. And he goes in with a bar barrel graveyard. I, or, yeah, bar barrel graveyard. Ooh, my bar barrel's coming in late. Not too good for us. But it is that time. Time to shine, double elixir. And I will send in the Dark Prince. He's going to probably play Valkyrie somewhere in a second. And the Baby Dragon's next. Oh wait, he played the Baby Dragon on the right, so we don't have to worry about that. And I will go in again here. He's going to use the... Yeah, that Lumberjack's on tower. It doesn't even matter. 
So it could be a two tower game. So I'm going to get a golem in the back here. He's going to try to defend on that side. And we take out his ice wizard. And look at that. We're going to three crown him. GG's to this guy. And yeah, guys, I will see you back in the next match. Alrighty, into the last match here, guys. Give this guy the good luck. And we've been pretty good so far. Lost one game, but I will take it. And he's going to have a Spear Gob Hut. Not what we like to see. So the first wave will connect. I'm okay with that. And he's going to Graveyard with nothing. Bar Barrel comes in late, but that's fine. As long as we take out these Skeletons here. And we do. So I will E-Dragon for all of his Spears. Oh, and we do... Okay, come on. Take that out. Nice connects. Beautiful. And he does Skeleton King. As long as we take out most of his stuff with the E-Dragon here, I'm fine with whatever happens. Skelly King's gonna be fine, like, you know, I'm not gonna be able to take that out, but... And I will Phoenix right on his push coming in. A little bar barrel. And we really didn't need the bar barrel, but we played it safe, so. And that barbarian might. Nah, it's not gonna have enough. Oh, so close, but so far. Alright, and we will collect her here. Try to get ready for a double elixir. Have 30 seconds to stall. And he's got the spear gob hut. And I placed that a little too early. My mistake, but what are you gonna do? And he comes in with his push here. Alright. I guess we will E-Dragon and Lumberjack. And we will bar barrel here in a second. Don't want to take too much damage. And E-Dragon should help us out here. And now we can get a Golem down in the back. It's only 50 seconds left. I'm feeling pretty confident. And those Goblins will get good damage, but nothing I can do about that now. And I will Tornado everything in. Dark Prince is down, and yeah, that Golem has a lot of health. Get a Lumberjack in. A Phoenix. He has the Bar Barrel. But we pretty much take out his Spear Gob Hut, and we have a nice push coming in. Another Bar Barrel. And yeah, that will be a good game. I don't think he can stop this. GG's to this guy, and uh, yeah, guys, thanks for uh, watching. Please leave a like and subscribe. I really appreciate all the love and support, guys. But uh, yeah, I will see you back in the next one. Peace out.